it is reminding me of the British economy at the moment. You just have to manage what you have. Conditional scarcity. Hi guys, it's me Ray and welcome to another video of mine. Guys, before we get started, I'm gonna need you to do a couple of things. First off, make sure you hit that subscribe button and don't forget to press that bell, ding -a -ling -a -ling, so you can keep updated of any time I upload a video. Guys, it is a wash day. Hey! Guys, it is a wash day. If you are interested in seeing what I'm going to be washing my hair with, make sure you stay tuned. So, I am going to be using some bomb beautiful products. So I bought this ages ago and I actually forgot I had them, had these products. So I checked in my arse and I was like, oh, let me use this to wash my hair. So Born Beautiful is a natural hair brand. It is black, British, yo, 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 black owned. I probably won't have this video up by, it is Black History Month in the UK, yeah. And I probably won't have this video up by then, so wait. <laughs> but yeah, so it's a black British brand. I believe the, the founder is from Birmingham. Birmingham, yeah. Huh? So what I've got here is their deep conditioner. If this does all my hair, I'm gonna be sharp. I'm gonna be real sharp. It's small, you see. Then I've also got the sulfate free shampoo. Then I've got a leave in. So yes, probably seal this with some oil. Just some random Ayurvedic hair mix that my sister Rhoda made. If you wanna buy this, I'll link it in the 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 description box down below support your girl she's tight she's little she's not little she's like she's getting older every day she's in her 20s now i'm just like girl i'm getting old i'm 30 now Ooh -wee. yeah so i'm gonna wash my hair i've detangled my hair and i just like plaited it what did i do they were they're in twist and i plaited them put it like this kind of cute kind of simple just we just out of my hair just just yeah so i'm gonna wash my hair i'm gonna wash my hair and um yeah in a bit let go it's like i'm doing the uh, what do they call it water only it's not doing anything. Look at that. Oh, basically the whole thing. Let's rest it out, I suppose. They're rationing ingredients. Yeah, it's so dirty. And there's not enough shampoo. Well, who is this? Blueberry Bliss? No. Born beautiful. Oh. We back! So I've washed my hair with the shampoo. Washed it and now I'm gonna deep condition my hair. Guys, that shampoo was so credit crunch in that there was hardly any in the bottle, but yes, it's a small bottle that I opted for. But it was really difficult getting my hair to, oh dear, what have we got here? We've got a knot, everybody. We've got a knot! No, it was so difficult getting my hair to like, uh, let me not say suds up, yeah, but I have to remember it's a sulfate free, what? Guys, this is not the one. It was difficult getting my hair to lava and then when it did lava, it just, it wasn't even lavering, it just, I didn't like the way it made my hair feel to be honest. I think this is another shot my hair's feeling. Look at that. I just need to stop using these products. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it wasn't great. It wasn't a great feeling on my hair. Oh, what is going on here? There's a massive knot. Oh. I'm just starting to think, some of these shampoos, what do they put in them? I did another wash day that I haven't uploaded and it's the same issue here. Wow, I know everyone is screaming. Why did you do that to my hair, guys? Please. Oh, dear. I don't know. Maybe I just need a... I probably do need a trim. But, yeah, I wasn't too fond of the, the shampoo. Uh, my hair doesn't even feel... It just has, like... 
I don't know if you can hear that. This is like a, not a film, but it's a very weird feeling. You know? Um, definitely going to, again, deep condition with heat. Bit sceptical, though, to... And I still got some soap in this hair, for goodness sake, Rach. Oh, my days. I'm surprised that happened. There's hardly any soap, to be honest. Look at you in Kijo. I think that was... Yeah, I wasn't not a fan, to be honest. Not a fan of the shampoo. Ah, oh, guys, it's like I should be washing my head loose. Ah, oh, yabba. Habba. Habba. This is not the one, guys, no. That was a bit of a struggle, uh, sectioning off my hair to, um, to get it ready for deep conditioning. So this is a deep conditioner, probably not going to do much for my hair, is it? It's very small, but that is what I bought. Consistency is like a cream, like a hair cream. It has like a bubble gummy type smell. I've got to be rationing it. So I'm going to just work on the end and work it in. Oh my. Part of me feels like even if I got like a bigger pot, it would have still been. A... This is like a hair cream. Wow. Mm. It is like softening my hair. So that's a good sign. So it's gonna do like that. Haha, <laughs> oh yeah. This is reminding me of the British economy at the moment. You just have to manage what you have. Conditional scarcity. Rachel, you did buy a very small pot. Yeah, I know, girl, but when I be putting it on my hair, it's not like, you see that? It's all black. It's not doing much. Like it's not, it's not like it's, it's just, it's making the hair feel softer, feels like a cream, more than a conditioner. I have a feeling though with heat, it's going to feel good. I finished applying the conditioner, going to deep condition. Not that impressed. I managed to like get, just guys, basically I cleared the pot. I managed to get some bits out, like it is clear. <laughs> if you got hair like mine, you might want to get a bigger part. But even so, I'm not wowed by it. It just feels like a cream. Conditioner, let go. Just finished with the cap. Yeah, that was okay. Let's rinse it and see. Ooh, so, rinse out the conditioner. Let's see how it feels. It's okay, hair is smellable. I didn't wash out the conditioner thoroughly and one of the reasons as to why it was because the way my hair was feeling with that shampoo, sister, <laughs> please. That's how your hair will start snapping all in, the, all in the name of YouTube view. And how many people even watch the thing, Steph? Yeah, so it does feel, <laughs> it's malleable and I think it's because I've got some conditioner in my hair and I'm not mad, sometimes it's not touching my scalp. And then she rubs it in. I know. Yeah. That that's the hack because sister, if I didn't do that, maybe we'll be I'll be extra upset. Yeah, it feels aight. It's aight, aight. I'm gonna moisturize and seal my hair. You can get these clips on my website. So I'm gonna use their leave-in and I'm gonna seal it in with an Ayurvedic oil that my sister made me ages ago, or we made together, I can't remember. She is selling them, so definitely check the link down below. So this is the leave-in. Okay. Very light. Can't put my finger on what that smells like. Very light. This is basic giving me Becky lights. Suitable for Becky's lights. My hair is a Bukola, not a Becky. Hello. It's like 
if you didn't want something to weigh your hair down, maybe offer this. I'm not wild, if I'm honest. I've said that it is quite oily, but which is good, but it's very light and very greasy. I think you're like, I don't know. I'm not that, I'm a bit disappointed I'm not that happy with the line. I just put a little bit of oil to seal it in and I'm just gonna twist it up and move on to the next section. My hair doesn't feel too bad. That shampoo was in there. Okay, it's, it's kind of growing on me. The camera died so I moisturized the tangled and all the other good stuff and then I went away and put my hair in these medium chunky twists boom um yes so guys that is the end of the video thank you so much for watching make sure you share this video with at least one friend have a good day Ray see ya